Hi there and welcome back. This is Sandeep from Tutorial Brain. I hope that most of you have installed brackets in your computer. If not, please visit my previous videos. And now let's see how we can use brackets. Before we get started, subscribe to our YouTube channel and click on the notification bell icon. So once you open the brackets, you see that at the top, you have these menus, right? So these menus are all related to files or operations related to the files. For example, how to edit a file or if you want to navigate from one place to another and we have this navigate. Similarly, we have this debug to debug in case if you have any issues or errors while coding in brackets and towards your right you can see here that this is called live preview option okay so this is live preview and just below that we have extension manager so overall if you just uh, divide brackets you can see at top these menus and towards your right these two menus or rather these two plugins you can just say and then towards your left we have these working files and then getting started. So these working files are like all the files on which currently the user is working. For example, if I'm working on this file that is main.css, you see that this particular file is present here. Similarly, if I just click on this index.html, you see that this particular file has opened here, right? So whatever files on which we are working, it will be shown under this working files. Now this particular area, is called as the project section so here you see that if you just click on that you see that there are a lot of projects on which i am working here for example this is one project that brackets g and we have this particular project then we have this project and so on right so getting started is also one of the project okay and you can also open a folder from here for example if you just click on this open folder you can open a particular uh, existing project as well if you see in this particular project that is getting started you can see that we have these type of files okay so we have screenshots so this is a folder then we have index.html then we have main.css so if i just come here and if i just give right click and you can see that we have options to create a new file again we have option to create a new folder we can rename an existing file similarly we can delete a file right and this option that is show in explorer so if i just click on this show in explorer you see that it has opened this particular location that is the location of the project okay so we are working on this getting started project right so by default if you see brackets will be installed here right that is program files and then brackets samples root and getting started now be aware that you cannot edit anything here brackets doesn't allow you to edit anything here now if you want to create any project you can create a project apart from this location so apart from that we have this particular area and this area is totally called coding area right so this is the first area this is the second area this is the third area so in third area we can combine working files as well as getting started so this is the third area and this one is the fourth area so this is the coding area right so we have just seen the overview of all these areas at a higher level now from the next video lesson we will go and we will start creating a particular project leave a comment below if you have any question i will try to answer it so thanks for watching it make sure you like comment and subscribe take care bye